Good afternoon, Melbourne. Welcome to the Moomba Birdman Rally. Are we all happy to be here? Oh, that's lame. Come on, people. Are we happy to be here this afternoon? Melbourne has finally turned on summer for us. How nice is it today? Brilliant afternoon. They're going to be 19 crazy and awesome competitors jumping off the side of this huge four metre platform today. I'm a bit nervous for them. Quite frankly, I wouldn't do it myself, but bless their hearts, they're going to give it a red hot go. We've got some great prizes to give away to the audience today as well as the participants. And uh, look, we've got our judges over here, which we will be meeting very shortly. And I think we're going to start the day today by talking to Chris KP from National Science Week. How are you going, Chris? Good, mate. How are you? Oh, look, I'm good. I'm a bit nervous for everyone. I'm terrified for them. <laughs> Fortunately, we, we can do some tests now to find yes. out how dangerous it is or is not. Um, right. And then they're still stuck jumping on into the bridge. So what happens now? It doesn't really matter. They're still going to jump. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. yeah but good. at least this way they know exactly what the likelihood of, you know, I guess, death is. Uh, right, good. And whether or not they've made a good plan or a terrible plan. Yeah, well, look, by some of the... I've seen some of the costumes and the crafts. Mm. I'm, you know, I'm quietly concerned. But, you know, good for them. Yeah, I'm impressed but worried, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so who are our crash, t crash test dummies today? Okay, so today? we have... Um, we were trying to find something that was, uh, you know, expendable, but that people would feel for. Yes. And we found these. Teddy bears. All right, so what you really want for this is a little bit of a headwind, which we've got. Yes. So if you've got one of these, one of these in your, as, your, uh, as your device, you're in a good place. And the headwind is picking up for me now. Okay, bear number one, hang glider. <laughs> oh, right. So it's actually gone underneath the ledge. Yeah. So it's gone into the miners' territory. Yeah, so possibly not a very comforting thought for those with hang gliders. No. That's okay, don't freak out though. Went down fairly quickly for a bear, I thought, too. Oh, and I love the surf rescue, we're gonna go and pick yeah, it up. Yeah, would you mind getting that for us? Right, what's the second craft we've got here? This looks interesting. Now, yes, what, what you're basically doing uh, when you jump off here is you're trying to balance two forces. One of them is gravity, which is pulling you down, mm. and the other is air resistance, which is, in theory, holding you up. This is effectively a parachute. This parachute was inspired by Leonardo da Vinci. Okay? Now, he's dead. He is really dead. But he didn't die jumping off a pontoon. Okay. Okay? And he didn't die for lack of ideas. So this is now <laughs> our bear on a parachute. Uh, I'm just going to hold it this way and launch it out and yeah. see what happens. I feel concerned. Um, right. Yeah, I'm, I'm not... The bear's not happy, I can tell you that right now. He's having a little piece of bear wee. Okay, here we go. Launch two. Bear in parachute. Oh! oh! Yeah, okay, no, so it didn't really uh, open. The parachute there. That's didn't even open. Too. Um, can you guys get that one as well? Oh, Thank gee you. whiz. Um, what we're going to do here is we're going to try and launch this bear with a rocket. Right. Now, I'm not sure if this is actually legal in terms of the competition rules. Good. I love that he's saying this. I'm not sure if this is legal. Hello, Melbourne, thousands of people. I think we've got some witnesses. I suspect it's probably not illegal. <laughs> um, it's certainly morally questionable. Can I turn it up the other way yet? Let's do that. Okay, and we'll just shove that, push it down really hard. Oh, we'll poor Teddy. This is doesn't look like the most comfortable craft to be he, attached to. He did agree to this on Friday. Did he? Um, yeah, no, not really. Um, oh, Chris is working very hard okay. here. Okay, right. look, I reckon we'll have a crack at it. I'm going to stand back because I fear this water may go everywhere. I guarantee it'll go everywhere. <laughs> All right, so we have a... Uh, we're going to pump this up now. A whole lot of air goes inside there. I'm sorry, dude. Hang in there. All right, pressure is building. I hope so. <laughs> Do you think anyone will use this technique today, Chris? I'm not sure that you're allowed to have um, a pressure, I think, but I do know there is some balloon action happening out there. Yeah, I saw some balloons, I saw some wings, okay. I've seen hovercrafts. Let's have a crack at this. All right. <laughs> Woo! Hi, Teddy. Now, Look, back. It, it, it did really good. It didn't yeah. go that far. That's awesome! And now that they've had a chance to see, you know, the possible approaches people will have, yes. they know that really everything should get a thumbs up. <laughs> really? I mean, let's face it. Everyone should get know. a thumbs up for taking a dip in the Yarra. Everyone's That's a winner. my opinion. Couldn't all right, well, more. thank you very much for that, Chris. Well, National Science Week is going all year round, really. We love science here.